This is the target for this unusually daring call for dismissal. Zhu Yongkang, China's most senior security chief. Seen as a hardliner responsible for the quelling of riots in 2008 in Tibet and then in Xinjiang a year later, it's his association with the disgraced party boss of Chongqing, Bo Xilai, that has made him vulnerable to attack. In the open letter distributed and reported widely on websites outside of China, the group of 16 middle-ranking party veterans call for his dismissal, along with Liu Yanshan, a top propaganda official. They accuse Zhu of manipulating the judicial system and the police. He did so, they say, to allow Bo Xilai to carry out his controversial crackdown on organized crime in Chongqing in his infamous administration known as the Chongqing model. Just as Bo Xilai is now being punished for his wrongdoings, goes the letter, so Zhu should also be held to account. The uh, general hope and expectation is that there will be a more pragmatic, more liberal uh, leadership and that uh, 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 political reform will be undertaken uh, seriously. And, uh, uh, well, it, it looks that the fact that uh, Zhou Yongkang, who has been uh, very, very unpopular because uh, his uh, increasing unpopularity is linked to the Bo Xilai case. Ahead of the all-important party congress, which will see the transfer of power to a new generation of Chinese leaders, this has been an unwelcome development of the ongoing scandal, with reports that police have warned the group of party veterans not to make any more trouble. It's thought Zhu Yongkang will be replaced at the upcoming Congress in any case, so marking the end of another key figure in the hardline Maoist faction that the current leadership hopes will fade away. What they want to avoid is another high-level sacking at this politically sensitive time. Rob McBride, Al Jazeera, Hong Kong.